Hi, and welcome to a veteran's edition of Game Day Barbecue. I am your host, Kevin Shaw. And today, we're going to do something traditional for the veterans. But before we get into that, I want to say a special thanks to all the veterans that have faithfully served the United States Army and Navy, Air Force, Marines, Coast Guard, and wherever capacity you serve this great nation. I myself have family members that have served not only um, in the Army, which I served in for 20 years, but my grandfather also served in the Army. I have a mother that's retired Air Force. I have an uncle that's retired Navy. I have a cousin that also served in the Navy. So from our household to yours, for all the users that have served, we appreciate your service and thank you again for serving our great country. Also, you might notice um, I'm still wearing a cowboy jersey, but this is going to be soon added by a put on that sauce apron. And for those of you who have, may have seen some uh, earlier episodes, I have a section in my episode where I get out my brush and my bowl of barbecue sauce, and we do the phrase that pays called put on that sauce. So that's going to be nice and on the apron. Be looking forward to that. Our website is still under construction, but those aprons are going to go there. I know there's going to be a hot seller, and I appreciate you helping the Marvel Not Network and Game Day Barbecue growing by your support of purchasing an apron from us. Okay, so traditional meal or traditional snack food or traditional tailgating food that we're going to do today is going to be wings. So we're going to do some garlic parmesan wings, which is going to be delicious. Um, in this garlic parmesan mixture, um, one of the secret things I didn't know about that my wife had told me about is using a little baking powder on them, and that brings more of a crispy texture to your chicken. So we're going to do that. We have some pre-mixed ingredients here. You can see those on your screen, and we're going to get started. So these are going to be garlic parmesan, and these are going to be naked. So these are going to get breaded with the same mixture, except there's flour added to this bowl. And these are going to end up going in the fryer. And then these are going to get split out. And we're going to do some hot buffalo and some going to stay regular because some of my family members just like it regular. So that's what we're going to do. So let's get started with the uh, garlic parmesan wings. So we're just going to take the mixture, going to shake it on in here. And you guys do remember that. I like to use my hands in my food. My hands are clean. Just got out of the shower. Wanted to be beautiful for you guys. So here it is. So we're just going to mix these all up. Get them nice and lovely. The way we like it. Can you guys see that? Doesn't take a long time. I think it's about 15 wings in here or so. So we kind of got it spaced out um, for the different types of wings that we want on the game day barbecue. All right, so as I mix these up and get these put in the pan, we'll be right back after these important messages. Champion character water, revitalizing not only your body, but your character as well. Do you have it in you? All right, welcome back to game day barbecue. So. We have our garlic parmesan mixture on our chicken here, so we're going to put these on the pan. So let's just get these going. And this is a nice big sized pan, so I don't have to uh, cram these too close together. I can space them out. And so that's what we're going to do. And that is looking lovely. And you get to be on the end by yourself. All right, so we're going to slide this one out the way. We're going to bring in our other ones. Got our mixture here, same way we did the first one. So we're going to put these in. Then we're going to mix it all up. And these are going to go into our cast iron pan. So make sure you're using cast iron. Just like that. I love to get my hands messy. All right. So those are going to go in the oven at 400 degrees for about 25 minutes. We're going to get these over into our grease and get them cooking. And then once everything's done, you'll see us separate them out. And then you get to see the glazes that go on the uh, finished product. So we will be right back. I'm going to wash my hands right now. Okay. So welcome back to Game Day Barbecue. So as you can see, we have our naked wings that are out. 
golden, crispy. We also have a hot buffalo sauce that we're gonna pour in here and then we're gonna mix those up with tongs. And we also have our garlic lemon pepper with parsley that we're gonna just smear across the top of these and make them look lovely. So it was a little hot, so let me start over here first. And we're just gonna pour this in. Oh, that smells wonderful. Mix these up. <clears throat> Just gonna turn them over. Woo, for those of you who love hot buffalo, these will hit the spot. I guarantee you. Okay, so we got that there. Let's go ahead and brush on. A glaze for these. <laughs> and you just take your time and do it right. Everybody's going to appreciate these garlic parmesan wings with a little added touch of parsley. So I'm gonna finish these up, get them ready, um, and we'll be right back to show you what the finished product looks like on Game Day Barbecue. All right, so welcome back to Game Day Barbecue. So the presentation is complete. We have our garlic Parmesan wings with parsley. We have our buffalo hot wings, and we also have our naked wings with some corn. And jalapeno poppers to top it all off. So we hope you enjoyed this episode of Game Day Barbecue. Uh, once again, to all the veterans, we appreciate all your support and we love you and thank you for your service.